Welcome to the Mischief, I'm Balan, and this is Heavens of Sorcery. Once again, we are here out on the platform and I'm about to actually build a structure. I said I was going to do this um, off camera, but I kind of lied a little bit because uh, I kind of figured I would do it here. Uh, I made a little area here and I, I put a little workstation here. I might even expand this to include like that, that little workbench there. I was thinking of putting a bed here, but then I don't know where I would end up. You know, I mean, I don't want to, I don't want to end up over that edge there. So I don't know. It is yellow, so it should actually kind of fit in a little bit. But here's what I was thinking. Uh, because in order to complete this quest, I need to make a mana battery and have it in my inventory with all this other stuff. Um, therefore, I don't know if it has to be all at the same time or not, but that's what I'm going to do. And then I can start doing this and I'll probably either speed it up or, or cut through as we do it. But what I need to do, according to this, is toss in soul sand, devil dust, and a diamond into nine buckets of mana. So hopefully this should do it, I hope. I guess we'll find out. Whoa, gosh. Oh, that was close. Okay. Yep. That was fun too, but <laughs> there we go. Whew. All right, I noticed that the, um, I think it's the balloon that I have, is giving me, like, step assist over one block height, <laughs> which is actually pretty darn cool. I mean, it's, it's nice that I can actually jump high enough now that I can go, like, about three blocks, I think. Something like that. But basically, I'm going to need to place this up there, and this should complete the quest at this point. Um, yeah. Yeah, that did. And I think my inventory, yeah, has 200 nether quartz and 40 mana orbs. Now that's fabulous to see. Oh, oh man. All right. So I've got all the rest of the stuff in here and I believe, let's actually have a quick bite. I haven't come up with any better foods as of yet, but if you have any ideas, let me know. Uh, let's go back here and we want to do the battery builder quest and visualize this. Now let's see if I can actually do this properly. Uh, so to see it, sometimes it's a little bit uh, weird. Actually, yeah, that's what I wanted. If I zoom all the way out, it gives me a little bit more perspective to see with. But if I look down enough, then you can see I'm actually there. I'm on the ground. That is above the ground. And it's very challenging to actually place. Let's try right clicking there. This looks about right. Let's change my uh, <laughs> settings back to normal. This should line up. No, that's not the right spot. I need to bring it back another block. How is it looking over here? Yeah, it's it's like jammed in the corner. All right, so I need to bring it back at least. Is it one block or two? One block. All right, so I need to have it so that this is no closer than that. So once again, this is just the easiest way that I've found to try and get this so that you can actually do it. Click again, it goes away, and then you can click it once more and hopefully get it just right. So if I put this here, that should be that should be right. Let's see here. Does this line up? It does line up and it lines up over here. Cool. All right. I gave myself a little extra space, but not not very much. So let's change my settings back. And then I think what I'm going to do is go into, I don't know, maybe a building montage. I don't know if speeding this up is going to actually work or not. I don't know if I'll play music or something, but I guess we'll, we'll find out. So here we go. All right, and that pretty much does it, except I need to place this mana battery up on top right there. And then remove this, and everything should be good. Oh, I'm starting to do a little float. That looks really cool, actually. Look at that. Okay, pretty neat. Um, and I 
I don't know if these need glass orbs or not. I would assume so. Everything else has glass orbs when they, when they look like that. So let's grab some of these. Little food noms quick. And then I can grab a little bit of glass. I have just enough to get four. So let's do that right now. One, two, there. Four glass orbs. And I also have some that have mana in them. But I thought this thing actually did it all by itself. I don't know. So let's find out. Oh yeah, it's doing stuff already. Three and four. Oh, look at that! It's just automatically filling the nearby station. Awesome. So these are already full. Did it use up any of the mana? No, it didn't. That is brilliant. Okay. Great times. Now we can actually do this. Now, while I was gone, though, and planning things out and plotting and stuff, I did do uh, a little bit of crop, you know, stuff here. By the way, the, the, the whoopee cushion is working as intended. <laughs> it's great. <laughs> Let's put some of these in here. Um, I've got some leftover stuff I need to put away. Let me get rid of these quick. All right, so as you can see, our, our mana reserves are pretty much empty at the moment, but I, I can always make more easy enough. I did end up uh, making myself an amethyst sword since I've got a bunch of them right now. It was really cheap, uh, and they're, they're as good as diamonds, just not as tedious to find and make I guess so I, I figured why not it looks kind of cool and chonky anyway so yeah it's neat I do have a bunch of stuff in here I made another staff um, it's I don't know how effective it'll be at most uh, reinforcements uh, it, it might be it might be useful I don't know I mean because I can just do one of these hi you are now my friend but he goes away rather quickly <laughs> <laughs> I don't know if that's because there's no enemies nearby or what. And it doesn't use up very much of my mana. Uh, and in here, I have a couple syringes and a couple orbs. So I've got a little bit of uh, backup, but not too much. I'm kind of thinking maybe at this point I take a good portion of these with me. And I put them in here. See, I can't, I can't right-click in there now. That is so weird. Let's put this down. Just shift-click it in there. There we go. <laughs> what's so difficult I don't know why it, it ha it's a little glitchy like that but still we've got stuff I've got some more of these uh, pearls and I could have made something a little more offensive but I don't know I mean if I'm going to be spamming it then I don't know how good I'm going to be with it because I don't have very very much for mana reserves right now I feel that I, I really need to progress in order to, to do that so in order to do so we're going to need to make ourselves some portals and I was thinking one of my favorite mods that I, I always wanted to get into uh, was the Aether. Because I, I love the ideas of like floating islands. I mean, heck, we're on one right now. As well as uh, the idea of the exploration of it. It's kind of like a, an almost Twilight Foresty type uh, mod, if I'm not mistaken. So I'm going to need Glowstone instead of Obsidian. And then Otherworld Cores to activate it. Um, I'll also need a place to put it. So, I need to see what kind of blocks I can use. Hmm, I think what I want to do is maybe use a variation of the netherrack um, underneath over here. And then maybe I'll just use some cobblestone for now uh, for building the area for the aether. And I'm kind of thinking that I have like three portals coming off of this, like uh, one over here one over there and they're all kind of like in the same area or something at least that's kind of how i'm feeling but for now i think i'm just going to do this i should probably be using a simul sax transtructor thingy but you know i'm just gonna kind of go with it how big is this platform one two three four hi <laughs> so it's eight wide one two three one two three all right well then i'm just gonna get this platform built up it's not gonna be anything fancy it's just going to be uh, functional so that we can actually go exploring this time. So immediately my thought from this is that, well, the portal itself, it could be bigger. But then that also uses up more glowstone because I think it actually said one of the next stops at first plants, paradise rather than hell, every bit is deadly if not even more so. Portal gateway to access the aether is built the same as the nether portal but with glowstone. It doesn't say anything about... Oh, wait, there it is. Can be various sizes. Frame shown is the smallest allowed. So I might actually make it bigger just because... Not because I can, but 
actually I'm gonna need a new axe as well uh, I might actually make an amethyst axe because why not one two three and then I'll grab a bit more glowstone because I'm thinking if I can add a little bit more here one two uh, heck I'll do four there we go so I should be good uh, and then I can make myself an axe I just need sticks there we are and I don't know what happens in the aether when you fall <laughs> so I guess we'll find out right let's put this in here I've got an axe I've got a pick I don't really have a shovel not too bothered by it but I guess I should probably bring one of those too because you never know the kind of stuff you might need and I probably should bring a pair of shears just in case there's stuff that uh, I can't normally use. Do I have any shears in here? I do. There we go. And now I'm just going to try <laughs> and survive in this other dimension. Of course, I will uh, ooh, grab some of those iron berries. You never know when you need them. But if I can make this here. Yeah, this will be fine. One, two, three. And then I can place these here. One, two, three. One, two, three. And then I need to place something. Let's place my shelter box because that's perfectly safe to place right here. Why not, right? <laughs> so can I jump? Yeah, three blocks high. Look at that. All right. One, two, three. And I have a couple left over. That's fine. Uh, so I'm just going to stand on this, mine it, and hope I don't lose this into the void. Whew. Okay, got it, and I think I'm ready to go. So I take this other world's core, and it says just click on it, right? Activate with another world's core. Oh boy. That's kind of creepy, but nonetheless, it's still there. I wonder if I can actually like chisel these as well, because I know that you can chisel glowstone. Not that it's the prettiest chiseling stuff, but... I might as well just go in and see how things go. Where's my shield? Uh, let me grab my shield out of here because you never know what you're going to experience when you go there. There we go. All right. And I got some diamond gloves or something, or did I not? Did it not complete it? Oh, I have to travel to the Aether. All right. Here we go. I'm in. And... I can't see very well to find it. I'm hovering above the sky. I did not bring any blocks with me. There is a giant structure in front of me. I don't know if these clouds are safe or not. Okay, that was that was a great trip. Um, <laughs> what I'm going to do is bring some building blocks with me. Get over this thing. Uh, so that I can actually build my way to a structure. And then I'm going to go all the way through. That looked wonderful. All right, here we go. I'm about to go back through, but before I do, let's open up this menu and I can put these diamond gloves in here. Look at that. Now I've got diamond glove, flaming diamond gloves. <laughs> and I do have a little bit of cobblestone with me now. I also grabbed a couple of foods while I was there. So, let's go. Falling into the void will not kill you. Okay, can I like walk on top of this? Cold air cloud. Okay, I don't know if these are safe to stand on. I try placing a block on them and nothing happens. So let's grab this. Oh gosh. I don't I don't know cuz I'm I'm holding shift. That that looks like I'm going to slide down into it, which is also kind of a concern, but for now let's just kind of go this way. And see what there is to find out here. Um, it looks to be nighttime. There's all sorts of crazy looking plants. There's a stairway. Hello? Already we're at a dungeon. Oh my gosh. Okay. This is craziness. Is there anything out here? These light angelic stones actually give off light. That's kind of cool. This is a huge structure. Is there anything out here worth of note? Any other entrances or did it like plop me right at the entrance? Because right now 
it's like there's the entrance portal and then i i have this looks like there's one mob inside hmm and there's something going on at the back i might as well finish having a look it looks like it's just an open area what the heck there's flying whales <laughs> excuse me i've got the toots uh it's I'm, i must be nervous Ooh, ambrosium ore i can pick this up and get ambrosium shards which is used for making a book of lore as well as torches nice that'll be useful later on for a uh, magic shield oh, wait is that that's superior shields too nice terrestrial agglomeration plate okay all right good to know this thing has like mineable stone on it as well yeah i didn't think so you can't mine the structure but you can mine outside of it which could be useful all right well let's see what we've got in here shall we i see chests ah evil chests bad evil mimic chests <laughs> okay those are the craziest mimic chests ever <laughs> are they all gonna do this now what the oh i don't think you should bother me you could get really hurt what okay hi valkyrie how are you you're not thinking of fighting a big strong valkyrie are you no i'm not <laughs> I don't want you look really cool um your halo is not attached to your head like mine is uh you don't mind if I like open these chests do you am I like in like golden dart shooter poison darts okay she's gone bye <laughs> I don't know what that was about well, there she is. Hi. Oh, gosh. Ah, you don't seem to, to mind this this critter here, do you? You don't mind it whatsoever. Nope. <laughs> okay. Quit, please. Uh, don't attack me. You seem to be pretty nice. There's a stairway here and more mobs. Oh, the don't activate until you actually right-click them. I tried swiping that thing and nothing happened. Okay, so far so good. This isn't that bad. So far. But, yeah. Yeah, I have a feeling this is going to change rather quickly. Alright, so let's head on up. And it looks like it starts to get a little bit darker up here. Okay. Ooh, okay. Skyroot Poison Bucket. Firework rockets, more torches. Uh, I might put the torches here. That could be useful. Um, I'm afraid to actually summon my zombie friend because I don't know if he's going to uh, attack that, uh, <laughs> that that lady down there. An Amoa egg. What? Rice. Another dart shooter. Torches. Interesting. Okay. These mimics aren't that bad because I'm just kind of like wrecking them right now. Um, whoa, jeez! Every time, every time she's like, <laughs> "I'm just gonna teleport to you and freak you the heck out." I'm just kind of looting your place, lady. Don't mind me. Uh, do you? Apparently, you live here. You you've got mimics taking over your and all of your like stores. It's not cool. Ooh, a Xanite pickaxe. I will take that. Free oh, jeez. Stop it. You're going to get yourself swiped if you just keep teleporting to me like that. Because I'll be doing it by accident or something. All right, she's not teleporting to me. Ooh, Xanite helmet plus one armor. Uh, I mean, I can put it on. Let's put it on for cosmetics sake, shall we? That way, at least it looks like uh, my stuff is a little bit more thematic. I'll eat my chili pepper and get a little speed boost. Uh, put these in here. Oh, gosh. Stop that. 
<laughs> I think you're the one that's pushing for a fight here, lady. Stop it. There we go. You're just trying to... D you're teleporting to me to just try and get in the way of my, my sword swipes. That's what's going on. Yeah, stop it. Stop it, lady. If I move, I know that there's a chance you might teleport to me. <laughs> oh, I can see the eye in the in the, the chest as well. <laughs> there we go. Hi, how are you? Can you teleport to me more? Ooh, enchanted darts. Oh, okay. So I actually have a ranged weapon now at this point. Uh, bamboo shoots. I think I can grow that. Golden dart shooter. I've got three of those. <laughs> I think that finishes off this area. Um, I see a whole lot of mobs on the radar, though. And I think that that might be above me. This doesn't go any higher, does it? No. So let's find out where that... There's multiple Valkyries. You're all just ready to attack at this point. Oh my gosh. Please. Please, no. Where's the way up? Okay, I'm really starting to worry at this point. <laughs> the place is just filling up with Valkyries. Um, is that because I've like... Hi. What's that? You want to fight? Aw, what a cute little human. Oh gosh. No, I don't want to fight. Is it because I've got like food? I don't think you should bother me. You could get really hurt. Okay. All right. <laughs> um, the, I, can I like actually... Am I just spawning in new ones at this point? Can I? I can't mine through yet. What if? What about the Xanite pickaxe? No. Uh, what about here? No. How do I get out to this area? Because right now I'm here, and according to this, there's actually an opening. Like, right here? At least it looks like it. I don't think that this Xanite pickaxe is really doing too much. I can make, I can break these. It must be the type of block. Maybe there's... This is all angelic stone. Hmm. I wonder if there's a specific type of tool that I need to break the... Oh. Hello? I guess I don't get in there. Um... How are you? It's a nice big room you've got here. Um, you've got a gold sword. The other ones didn't have gold swords. Are you going to attack me? <laughs> Please don't attack me. Valkyrie Queen. Hi. That's a nice chair you got up there. This looks like a bathroom tile set. You've got some water on the sides. You've got these cool looking saplings growing. Um, it's very cold up here. Obviously. I guess I'll talk to you. What do you, what do you have to say? Hello, the Valkyrie Queen. What can you tell me about this place? I wish to fight you and never mind. What can you tell me about this place? This is a sanctuary for us Valkyries who seek rest. Uh, never mind. Uh, she's got 500 health. Just a reminder, I've, I've got 20. <laughs> oh my god. Uh, what are these things? Golden Oak Saplings. All right. Golden Oak. Oh, okay. What? You can get gold from them? That's pretty cool. Uh, suddenly I wish that I brought like some, uh, uh, what do you call it? The um, bone meal just to see if it works. You've got glowstone everywhere up here. You don't mind if I like, oh, there's wool. I'm just going to sit here, do you? Whoa! Oh, jeez. Okay, that one grew. Uh, I might, I might see if I can take this one. You don't mind if I take this, do you? Of course you don't. You wouldn't mind at all. <laughs> You're a very, very approachable uh, lady. Look at this. This is actually really pretty. Can I? Uh... Yeah, it's a harvest tool with an axe. You don't mind? No. You're not going to attack me, Miss Valkyrie Queen. I'm just going to kind of, you know, chop a little bit of this. 
Am I getting anything from it? It's just Skyroot logs. They don't have the gold texture on these ones anymore. Does it need to be like mined out in a different way? Oh wait, what if, what if I use the Xanite pickaxe or something? No, no. <laughs> I just thought it was worth a try. I could try the molten pickaxe, see what happens. Does it like... I know it says axe, but because it has an auto smelting thing? No. No, it doesn't. All right, well, I guess I'll just chop these and see what comes of it. Uh, nothing? How about those shears that I've got? I'm getting more saplings. So I'm getting a few of the leaves. And then I guess I'll just chop the rest of this normal stuff here. Because there's no more wood up there, right? I don't think so. Let's just deposit some some of this <laughs> so I can get up here and aha there was a little bit left so the stuff looked like it was uh, gold but it didn't give me any when I harvested it I bet I wonder if that's like another you have to use a special tool thing for it why would I want to fight her I don't understand that <laughs> Hmm, I should I could probably just start poison dart enchanted darts. I could just start trying to use one of these. Let's try golden dart first and see what happens. Oh, it worked. And I got I got it back. Okay. This is really really quick and easy. Um I will also try and get a little bit of dirt so I can grow my own saplings. You don't mind, do you? I'm just kind of like stealing all your stuff and I don't know what this is going to involve <sighs> okay um, I should probably just go back and deposit all my stuff but I have a feeling I'm going to die so yeah let's just let's just risk it for the biscuit here all right Helor, I wish to fight you very well then bring me 10 medals from my subordinates to prove your worth then we'll see Oh, okay. I'll return when I have them. Take your time. Okay, so now I have to go fight the other uh, Valkyries. Hi, how you doing? You've got 50 health. You do little flighty jumps and you 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 hit pretty good. There's, there's one metal. Okay, all right, I'm learning. So she's going to have some flying attacks. Are the rest of these ones all going to attack me on sight now that I attacked one of them? I don't know. Uh, let's find out, I guess. No, actually, they don't seem to mind. Yeah, one at a time. I will take one at a time. There, There's another medal. Actually, I might as well just go get it. <laughs> let's just take a little bit of food. I hope that Hillor doesn't have like massive damage attacks because I don't think I could handle that. You're gonna try and attack me from. You don't know what you're doing. Here, let me help you. Where are you at? There you are. You're falling downstairs. There we go. That that's three. Is there anything else these can be used for? No, it doesn't say it. I give up. Jeez, <laughs> I didn't realize they were saying stuff. Oh, cute little human, right? You're gonna regret that. Ow. Actually, that one was a bit tougher. Uh, ow, fine. Here's your medal. <laughs> I don't think I'm gonna have enough food for this kind of battle. Oh my gosh, there's three of them. All right, let's... Ow. I can't get it up. Back up. Back up. Back up. Oh my gosh. Okay, that, that kind of hurts. What if I do one of this? One of these? Reinforcements. He doesn't seem to care. Reinforcements, my butt. <laughs> okay, this is this is a little bit cheaty. Okay, got her. <laughs> That's five so far. This makes six. Okay, let me just get the other side of this wall here, and then when you jump, you can't make it to me. Okay, now you're in for it, right? I don't, I don't feel quite as threatened as I once did by you, now that I know how to cheese you a bit. Where are you going? 
Oh, oh, you tricked me. You tricked me. You got a great sword. You guys do some decent damage with those things. There we go. All right, you win. That's eight. I need to eat food. Oh boy, this is not going to go well. Uh, if anything, I probably need to trade out this. Uh, take this. And I can't put it in here. For some reason. I don't know why. Let's put this down. I will put this in here. I will take out Thrive so that I can heal. <laughs> I don't know if this is going to heal her or not, but I'm going to try it. Let's try. Hey, okay, I'm healing. Nice. That was good. And now I'll finish filling up my uh, food bar there. That used up a lot of my mana, though. Hmm. Back off, lady. Just stay back. If I just keep swiping you fast enough, you end up getting bounced back. So that's kind of a thing. Oh, hi. Excuse me. <laughs> that's nine. There we go. And that's 10. Here's your medal. I now have 10. Boy. Oh boy. Um, actually, let's cast Thrive. Heal myself up. And then I need to place this down. And get out the mana booster. Use it. Bink. And that gets me some mana. If I can deposit some of this stuff, let's get rid of this junk that I don't need right now. <laughs> White Moa egg. That should be entertaining. I'm, I'm curious to know what I'm going to get from that. Aether dirt. Iron berries. I might need those. Um, so I can just stand there and heal while I'm sitting in one spot. That might be a good idea. Um, Skyroot poison bucket. <laughs> get her to get poisoned, but I think I'll just ditch that for now. I've got these. I've got some darts so I can shoot from a distance. <sighs> All right. Let's grab the mana orbs, mana booster, and we're going to combine one of these here. I don't think I need the torches uh, or a shovel, so I'm going to put hmm, this back in here for now. And I think <sighs> this will have to do it, because I, I don't know how, how I'm going to fare against somebody with 500 health, 10 times the, the amount of health. Oof. Oof. All right, let's go back down. Hi, lady. How you doing? Let's let's end the episode on a high note, maybe. Um, go easy on me. Uh, I wish to fight you. Very well then. Bring me ten medals. I'm ready. I have the medals right here. Now then, let's begin. Okay. All right. Where are you going? I just... Sh what? What? Um, did you just, like, shoot the dart back? That is actually a really cool effect. Um, is that going to hit me if I, like, run into it? I bet it is. Um, so... I don't think I can shoot you with stuff. <laughs> based on that. And you don't seem too bothered by me right now. There we go. This will be your final battle. Oh, okay. So I can't... I can't... Uh... Oh, run. Run, run. Okay, she is... Uh, she's... She, I don't know if she's taking any damage from these. Or not. No. They are not doing anything to her. <laughs> I can pick these up and they don't do much. Oh, God. Let's just... See if I can get you in a, a good series of hits here. I, I'm hearing like the things that I was using before falling. All right, this isn't too bad. Oh God, what is that? No, 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 no. I don't want your your weird thundro ball. Get get your thundro ball out of here! Ah! <laughs> That's <laughs> rude. Back off. It dead. It dead. That means I can start attacking you again. Okay, this is actually a pretty good fight. 
it's it's challenging to a point, and then tossing in the thunder balls means that you don't just get the straight up cheeser 100%. You know? Can I can I hit you a few more times here? There we go. Because I don't think that I'm going to be able to eat. Oh, she almost got a hit on him, hit on me. I don't want to get hit because I don't think I'll have enough time to heal. Uh, this is a very high movement battle. <laughs> Stop it. Stop. Stop. No. No. Back up. No more Thundro Balls, okay? I'm done with Thundro Balls. I'm, I'm glad I... Oh, I've got you in the corner. You're cornered. You're mine. Oh, you're truly a mighty warrior. Ooh, I got a gold sword. Really? <laughs> Minus 5% attack damage. And a silver key. What? What's the silver key going to do? And I'm also curious to know... Oh, oh! Hey, there's a chest there. Is there anything underneath the wool? No, but I still want some wool because I don't have access to this per se. So I'm gonna grab. I'm grabbing your seat cushions, lady. What do you think of that? What's down here? We've got a treasure chest. Um, do I just mine it? Oh, I use the silver key, right? Nice! Okay, a Neptune chest. Wow. Neptune armor, a lightning sword, a holy sword, and an invisibility cloak. <laughs> Hello! That's pretty good stuff. That's awesome loot. All right, let's uh, let's put on this stuff. Two and eight. It's as, it's as good as uh, diamond. So that's cool. That actually increases my armor a bit. Uh, I did not get a hat or helmet, sadly, but at least I still have my my, what is it, the Xanite helmet, just to kind of offset my colors so I can be totally rainbowy. Um, a lightning sword, plus 10 attack damage on the holy sword, the lightning sword. I don't know if this actually does, like, lightning damage or something. Let's, we can try these out. An invisibility cloak. Can I put, oh wait, this is going to be not in baubles, this is going to be aether. <gasps> <laughs> I'm invisible. Oh, that's awesome. Okay. <laughs> that is so cool. Can I like place it anywhere else at the moment? No, but still. Wow. Okay. I might try that and see what happens. Did the, wait, the entrance to her place is gone. Um, how do I get out of here? Or now that I've defeated her, can I actually mine stuff? Oh, okay. I can actually mine stuff now, and I can take these blocks with me. Light angelic stones. Oh, nice. This would be great for building, too. <laughs> At the very least, I'm just going to open this up, and then I'm going to mine my way out. A shortcut. <laughs> that was pretty good. I, I enjoyed that. I don't have any food left. And I don't want to eat iron berries, so I think what I'm going to do is head down here and then jump through the portal uh, once I can place some blocks. There we go. Let's put down this one, this one, this. Okay. I feel a little bit safer about that now. I also was able to get a little bit of cold air cloud, which looks really pretty because it's got like little spiral patterns on them. Oh my gosh. So good. And here we are back home. Oh, feels good. Feels good to be back home. And as you can see, I am I am very uh, somewhat not somewhat partial visible. I think I think there's a little glitch. The invisibility cloak. Yeah, there we go. <laughs> Going through the portal. <laughs> anyway, let's take that back off because uh, otherwise. It's just going to be really weird right now. I hope you guys have been enjoying the series. If so, be sure to give a like, comment, subscribe. And as always, be sure to come visit us on Twitch and help us spread the mischief. <laughs> I forgot I could do that. <laughs> anyway, if you guys uh, don't mind, please also turning on the notifications so that you, you too can see more episodes of Heavens of Sorcery. I'll see you guys next time. Bye.